Oh, now I'm busy writing all these checks for Kara's broken pipelines. Planning for the Energy East pipeline is so hard. Hey, how's the oil and gas company going? It's going really good. I'm working really hard on a project right now. How's your business? Oh, it's fine. We, as oil and gas CEOs, believe that oil and gas companies should find safer ways to transport oil and gas. These resources are important to our economy. Did you know we use oil and gas for just about everything in our daily life? Think about all the benefits that they give us. Now think about all the risks. Oil and gas can pollute our environment, harm all types of animals, and even cause fires and explosions. We have to come up with a solution. Luckily, we have just the thing. Oil and gas is polluting our environment. It's polluting the air we breathe in and it can cause illnesses like lung cancer. Fossil fuels have carbon stored inside and when burned, a gas is released to the atmosphere. This gas is called carbon dioxide and is causing global warming. It can cause lots of illnesses such as lung cancer and heart disease. 2.4 million people die each year just because of pollution in the air. Things that pollute our air are called pollutants. Some examples of pollutants include carbon monoxides, hydrogen oxides, hydrocarbons, and sulfur oxides. When oil goes through the pipelines, it can leak out of the system and make its way into the ocean and harm the sea life. This is a picture of a healthy turtle. This is a picture of a turtle in an oil spill. This is a picture of two otters in the Valdez oil spill. Lots of animals get harmed in oil spills. For example, birds and otters. Oil ruins the repellency of a bird's feathers and injures so many otters. When these poor creatures attempt to clean themselves, they get poisoned by the oil that gets stuck on their feathers, scales, skin, and fur. Natural gas is highly flammable. If the gas leaks, there is danger because even if there's a tiny spark or a flame in the air in this leak, it could cause a fire or even an explosion. Gas can leak if one of the pipes is damaged. For example, some person could be digging a hole and accidentally break one of the underground gas lines. Natural gas could even leak out of a stove or an appliance if it's not properly hooked. When natural gas is fresh out of the ground, there's no way to see it or smell it. This is the reason companies have to give it a bad smell, so it will be noticed right away. So oil and gas is very dangerous. It can pollute our environment, cause illnesses like lung cancer, harm sea life by leaking into the ocean, and cause explosions if the pipe is damaged. So we believe oil and gas has many benefits but also risks. We should use these resources responsibly and reduce their impact on the environment. As we said, we believe oil and gas companies should find safer ways to transport oil and gas. To do this, companies need to make stronger pipelines so there's no chance of a spill or explosion. We should use wind turbines so that our environment is not polluted. Wind power is a clean source. Wind turbines don't produce acid rain or greenhouse gas. Things like power plants rely on the combustion of fossil fuels, coal, or natural gas. This is why we should stop with pollution and oil spills and make a change. Hey Carl, how's it going? Yes, I'm working very hard on the project that makes the oil pipes stronger. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Carl, are you serious? One of the oil pipes just broke? Hold this. I really need to stop.